The ref's calling for the match to start, and here we... Oh, no! This is it. These two superstars will test each other's will to determine who the best competitor is here tonight. Cesaro taken down. Hey, Cesaro, you're not going to swing anybody from that position. Better get up. The future's looking great here. Reversal. Cesaro showing his promise. And he gets leveled. Great move. Oh, and he got dropped. Keep your eye on the future. You can practically see the pain in his face right now, thanks to that tremendous move off the ropes. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? And he reversed it. Good move there. Oh. Nice move. What a fierce kick. Reversal. Cesaro showing his prowess. Eyes open. Playing my games. Yeah, a little intimidation there. What an amazing kick. The kick connects. Yeah. the shoulder up. Don't expect a lot of mercy to be shown here. What a punch! Cesaro reversing it. Incredible. The future saw that coming. What a move! What a smart move! He's got him hooked! Uh oh, big move coming. The future. Big time move by the future. There's a cover. Antonio gets the shoulder up, and that, ladies and gentlemen, was close. Should do it right there. No, he kicks out at two and a half. He's got evil intentions. He saw that one coming. Watch it. Oh, that did it. You can see the pain shoot through the superstar's body off that slam. Going to the top. He needs to dig way down deep if he wants to keep going now. Heads up! Shoulders down. Two.
Boy, he is really tired now. That tank of his has to be reading empty. It has to be, King. But I still don't see him giving up. I think everyone knows how that must feel. Quick cover, early kick out. Referee right on top of the action. If you just joining us, welcome to Monday Night Raw. I'm Michael Cole, alongside the Hall of Famer, Jerry, the King Lawler. And Cesaro is floored. Yeah, the King of Swing finds himself in a very precarious situation now. Roundhouse kick. He's heading back up. And then punch lands hard. And he gets tossed back in the ring. Rolling out of harm's way. Smart strategy there. And he gets back in. Look out! The damage has definitely been done. There's the pin! Can his opponent kick out? Countered by the future. was a heavy shot. He's still not through. The future again, heading to the top. This match has taken so much out of this guy. He's not going to get... Oh, oh man. <laughs> That'll take the wind out of your sails. His shoulders are down. Two. Three. The future wins. We got a couple of highlights here. Let's check them out. Let's go to the highlights here. Oh boy, that was a spectacular performance. Let's see some of the highlights. That match was incredible. I can't believe what we saw during it. Let's take a look back at what exactly happened during this one. You have to like this display. Well, I like the display, but I don't know how much trust there is in the ring. The ref's calling for the match to start, and here we... Oh, no! Rusev has the ability to end this match very quickly. Yeah, there's so many ways he could beat you, particularly the accolade. Once that gets slapped on, it's over. Rusev is looking incredibly impressive as of late. Rusev doing a little grandstanding here. As we get started, what has to be going on in the mind of Dolph Ziggler? Oh boy, if you look up momentum in the dictionary, you're going to see a picture of this guy. No matter the odds, he keeps finding a way to win. Dolph Ziggler turns it around. Rusev reverses it. Up straight. around the arena. That 
move will knock the wind right out of you. Submission locked in tight. This could do it. Really going to work here. Just wrenching that thing. Just a dominating display. Yeah. I think we could see a lot of punishment inflicted here. Great athleticism. And he hits the drop kick. What impact. The kick connects. And it's Dolph Ziggler with the reversal. Oh, wait. Nice reversal. things are going through that mind right now. When you get in control like this, you want to throw everything at your opponent. That could be what we're seeing here. Ziggler works his way out of trouble. And Ziggler's quickness never ceases to amaze me. Rusev, quick to get the shoulder up. I can't believe this is a no disqualification match. We can see anything in this one. These no DQ matches are so dangerous. What incredible impact. Oh my, Rusev is in position. Oh my gosh, he might make his opponent tap right here. Oh man, does that look painful. This is serious gut check time. Let's go to the highlights here. Well, let's take a look at some of those highlights. Here is your winner, Rusev. Finally, thankfully, the match comes to an end. Complete domination is what that was. My goodness. Well, these two superstars respect one another, and that's where it ends. I mean, they couldn't be more different in every possible way. Get ready to see one heck of a fight. Good night. He's putting those educated feet to good use. Uh, CM Punk is conjuring up some good momentum here. John Cena, filled with heart and determination. Right now, what must be going through his mind, King? When you think of the personal life of the very private CM Punk, you have to think of him talking about loving this business, admiring legends growing up, such as Ricky the Dragon, Steve the British Bulldogs, Red Hitman Hart, Randy Macho Man Savage. Hey, what about the King? They've all played a part in CM Punk becoming the best in the world. trouble there oh what a smack Michael you're definitely right about CM Punk guarding his privacy you're also right about how Punk idolized so many legends in this business a young CM Punk watched sports entertainment in Chicago 
and was so influenced by what he saw that he decided at an early age all he wanted to be was a WWE superstar. Oh, and to be the best in the world. Watch out! Hey now! Oh, and down goes Cena. See a punk gathering attention in a hurry. Oh, the reversal by John Cena. You know, we were talking about John Cena's childhood in the Northeast, but right. with all this talk about shoveling snow and cold weather, doesn't it really come down to the work Cena does in the gym instead of the weather when he, when he had to put up with his kid? I mean, I don't know. I'm sure those winners toughen Cena up a bit, but I can't imagine that did more for him than working out in the gym and in the ring. Well, you're right. You can't just roll out of a snowbank and into the squared circle, Michael. But I know John Cena's dad, and I'm sure as a kid, Cena had to build his character by shoveling snow and walking through his share of blizzards. He's got evil intentions. Reversal. Watch it. What a move rattling the ring. I just can't get over what we saw. That was so great. You know, it's remarkable. When John Cena has his adversary incapacitated, there's always the very real possibility that he will go to the submission hole that he has developed into his trademark, the STF. Oh, yeah. Cena doesn't miss many chances to lock that hold in, does he? Whoa. He's in big trouble. Ow. He's measuring. Oh, man. <laughs> that don't take the wind out of your sails. Look at those eyes. Oh, yeah, this could be big. The Anaconda Vice Finisher of CM Punk that we're talking about has some international flavor. Oh, my. CM Punk. What does John Cena have to do with this? He thinks he has it. Oh, man. I thought John Cena was done there. there the cover and a kick out if you're just joining us welcome to monday night raw i'm michael cole alongside the hall of famer jerry the king lawler oh man right on the button and cena goes down why is the guy his opponent and what's he going for here and again, Punk going to the top rope. CM Punk has embraced the straight edge attitude, and most of his tattoos represent a life of social discipline and abstinence. He may get the three counts right here. John Cena gets taken down. Oh, that would have dropped any superstar on the roster. He was one step ahead on that one. Incoming! Uh oh CM Punk has capitalized on opportunities and taken back momentum. He's begging for it. Not this! CM Punk, what a maneuver! Can he score the pin? Two, three. CM Punk wins. CM Punk wins. And here's just some of the action we saw during the match. Let's go to the highlights here. Oh, they mesmerized the WWE Universe in that match. And here are just some of the highlights.
I can't believe what we just saw. Highlight after highlight. Let's look at some of them right now. Uh-oh, Michael, what happened to the light? Oh, no, Ken, you know what this means. Ah, it's the Undertaker. He's here. When Undertaker sets his sights on a superstar, there's only one thing he wants. We could be seeing a WrestleMania match between these two. here King have you ever stood across the ring from somebody as creepy as Bray Wyatt well let me tell you Cole I've faced my share of wackos but I don't think I've ever went up against somebody as eerie as Bray Wyatt what do you think's going through Bray Wyatt's mind yeah let's talk about it the thing is nothing that he does in this match is going to be an accident He's going to take chances to punish his opponent tonight. When you're talking about incredible counter. Oh, cool. Look at that. Now that's how you hurt an opponent. Neither individual is going to back down here. What's he going to do here? He almost took his head off with that lariat. And there are those educated feet. He's still not through. And there's the reversal from Sting. You know, Michael. There have not been too many stars in this business that are six foot two inches tall, weigh 250 pounds, and can use so many different abilities all at once to defeat opponents of so many shapes and sizes. It's one of the reasons that Sting has enjoyed such an amazing career. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? This reversal there. All kind of things underneath that ring. Steel chairs, tables, ladders. Be careful, Cole. Remember, they're... Wow! If he keeps this up, this could be over quick. And I think it's obvious that he'll stop at nothing to win here tonight. Folks, it's become a legend in our business that when Sting was training for his career in the ring under the legendary Red Bastine, he also trained with the man who became the ultimate warrior. They eventually formed a tag team and ended up in the same territory I was in back in Memphis, Tennessee. Oh, launched back into the ring. And there's the reversal from Sting. What kind of devastation will we see now? I don't know, but I think we're about to find out. These no DQ matches are so dangerous. See that? Oh man, it doesn't get much closer than that. Well, I'd get out of the way right about now. Now back to the ring. Good lord, he's just hell bent on naming his opponent. Oh, not again. Not again. Boy, he was able to reverse it. Get out of that. And there's the reversal. Sting with a great offensive show. Our work is being put in by Sting. Just 
look at this. You can see the results from that move. Oh, directly on that table. Woo, a little showboating going on here. He's having a seriously hard time getting back to his feet after that. Oh, ow! And it looks like we could be heading back into the ring. in the arena rafters, dressed in all black, and handed out beatdowns with his baseball bat. When that match finally happened at Starcade 97, it was a major... He's going for the pin! This could be it! And that's the match! We got a couple of highlights here. Let's check them out. Let's take a look at some of those highlights. Whoa, I can't. Oh, those WWE competitors tore this arena apart. Let's take a look back on some of the incredible highlights. Expect to see some high flying from Jimmy Uso in this one. That's right. Somebody alert air traffic control. We're going to have a flying Uso. Collar and elbow battling for control. A flying forearm. What can you tell the WWE Universe about Ryback, King? Well, generally speaking, I like what I've been seeing from him. A few more wins under his belt, and he may be unstoppable. Suplex. Tie up. This is about skill and power. Hey, Jimmy Uso finding a path of destruction currently. Wow, he's still down. Oh my gosh. the elbow. Watch out. Did you see that, Cole? Talk about getting your spine adjusted. Jeez. did some damage. Oh, out of nowhere. Oh! Look out what's going on here. He saw that one coming. That's it. He's out. 
doing whatever it takes to win. He's done. Look out! That's it. He's done. Right back. And will this be it? When it comes to skills in the ring, Jimmy Uso possesses the speed, diverse offense, amazing leaping ability, and the toughness that you'd expect from... He may get the three count right here. A counter by Ryback. Yeah, Ryback proving he's more than just muscle. There's a nice reversal by Jimmy Uso. Oh, Ryback did not like that. Doing whatever it takes to win. Watch out! And he reversed it! Good move there! He got him! Cole, it's like I said before. Jimmy Uso's incredible skills are based in the tradition of the Anawaii family, but Jimmy's bringing them into the 21st century against anyone that gets in his way. Boy, he is really tired now. That tank of his has to be reading empty. It has to be, King, but I still don't see him giving up. Four. Whoa! I've driven by car accidents that look prettier than that. And we're going back between the ropes. And this is going to return to the ring. And now, Jimmy Uso could have this match in the bag. Ow. He gets out of trouble there. Superstars keep doing it. Wow, Jimmy Uso just timed that perfectly. Jimmy Uso smells blood. Doing whatever it takes to win. How much more? How much more are you willing to pay to win this match? This is unreal. Oh! Oh, man! Ooh. Oh, man! Wow, Jimmy Uso just timed that perfectly. Is just dangerous and I think he's begging him to bring it oh. perhaps Jimmy Uso has this match won now people well going to the top I risk It looks like Jimmy Uso has got the momentum. And here we see it from this angle. The referee's calling for the bell. The match is over. Let's go to the highlights here. We got a couple of highlights here. Let's check them out. Oh, 
Oh, there were some unbelievable highlights. Watch this. Oh, they threw everything they had at each other in this match. Let's look back at everything that happened. Here is your winner, Jimmy Uso. A lot of aggression there. Well, that was just a one-sided beatdown. Without question, this man, Daniel Bryan, is one of the most popular superstars in recent memory. What do you think Daniel Bryan's feeling right now? Michael, I had the chance to talk to him before the show, and I can't even pretend to repeat what he said. The fact is, this is already personal, but I have a feeling it's about to get ugly. You know what? There isn't a crowd in this country that doesn't love pulling for the underdog. And you'd have to say that in a lot of ways, Daniel Bryan has been one of WWE's ultimate underdogs. way. Smart strategy there. Did you see that, Cole? Talk about getting your spine adjusted. Jeez. Oh, the elbow connects. You know, I think people admire Daniel Bryan's journey to get to WWE. They admire Daniel's guts and his fortitude. His never-say-die attitude, and the fact that when that bell rings, Daniel Bryan's going for it. I mean, all of it. Oh, those steel steps getting used now as a weapon. Man. And that implement connects again. Those steps still being used to tenderize their opponent. Woo, a little showboating going on here. These no DQ matches are so dangerous. Oh, man! Michael, Hulk Hogan defeating Andre the Giant at Red Head first right into the table. Great move. What's he think he's going to do with that? Wow, if he keeps this up, this could be over quick. Once again, momentum has changed. Oh, not again. Not again. Watch it. Oh, stop at the last second. Uh oh he's got it again. Oh, my. Get the medics down here. He's going to be bruised from head to toe before this one's over. Oh, not again. Not again. The moment that kept an entire world on the edge of their seats took place on March 29, 1987. Hulk Hogan versus Andre the Giant saw more than 93,000 fans descend upon the Pontiac Silverdome to witness history. Hulk Hogan defended his... Uh oh He's up on the table. We might want to move. I love watching these replays. These no DQ matches are so dangerous. Boy, there's no way he's going to be able to stand after that. Oh, and did you hear the impact? He's not exactly popping up to his feet here. Well, what do you expect, Michael? Did you see what just happened? You know, Michael, there's a reason why history is called, well, history. When Hulk Hogan clashed with Andre the Giant at WrestleMania 3, the crowd of 93...
5,173 set a new indoor attendance record that stood for more than 20 years. Hogan and Andre is considered by many the greatest rivalry our business has ever known. To the temple. Uh oh, look where he's going again. I don't know how much more damage he can take. Well, when you're a worldwide icon like Hulk Hogan, there are literally cameras everywhere. But did you know one of Hulk Hogan's loves growing up was music? That's right, before he entered professional wrestling, the Hulkster was in a band and known in music circles as one mean bass guitar player. Remember, there are no countouts in this contest. This match could end up anywhere. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? And he gets tossed back in the ring. out of harm's way. Smart strategy there. You know, it's pretty impressive when you think about it. Hulk Hogan was rocking stages and crowds before he set foot in the ring and took WWE straight into the entertainment stratosphere. Back into the ring now. I'm not sure if he knows where he is right now. And he gets back in. He anticipated that move perfectly. Things are about to get ugly. Hulk Hogan is taking advantage. Look out! He's got a chair! Well, that steel chair has done the damage. Oh, man! Did oh. you hear that? What's he doing now? God almighty, that plate's got to be shattered. right now. Shoulders down. Two. Three. I don't believe it. This one's over. We got a couple of highlights here. Let's check them out. And here's some highlights. Oh, they mesmerized the WWE Universe in that match. And here are just some of the highlights. What a physical match. Uh-oh. Look at that stare. Oh, no! Come on. You won the match. Enough's enough. And this one's destined to be a human demolition derby. Oh, hard shot by the future. The future's looking great here. 
Neither individual is going to back down here. Oh, and he lands that one right to the head. What incredible agility. Oh, a serious knockout blow. Tie up. This is about skill and power. into the ring now. Oh, look at the emotion. Now back to the ring. And Damian Sandow reverses it. Oh, and that shot was dialed in. Oh, oh what a shot. Oh, wow. Uh-oh, look at this. Oh, trying to put him away. Oh, jeez. No, not again. Oh, no. Massive damage done there. here. And here's just some of the action we saw during the match. Here is your winner, Kevin Owen. He gets a big victory here tonight. Love him or hate him, that was an incredible match. And we are live with our main event. You can feel the electricity in this one. Dolph Ziggler going for it. As we get started, what has to be going on in the mind of Dolph Ziggler? Well, generally speaking, I like what I've been seeing from him. A few more wins under his belt, and he may be unstoppable. Into the tie-up. Who's going to get the upper hand? Rusev finding a path of destruction currently. The drop kick, what impact. Did you see that, Cole? Talk about getting your spine adjusted. Jeez. Nice move. He's taking out the trash. And he's forced back in the ring. Rusev is looking incredibly impressive as of late. Ow! Ooh. He gets out of trouble there. Rusev better shake out the cobwebs. You hear how his leg connected? A match that Dolph has mentioned in interviews that he would more than welcome would be a 60-minute Iron Man match with none other than Daniel Bryan. I think it's safe to say that every WWE fan would buy a ticket to see that match live and in color. What 
Watch it. Ooh. Oh, out of nowhere. Man, that was a vicious elbow drop. another one he's putting those educated feet to good use Ziggler versus Brian 60 minute Iron Man match Michael I gotta tell you I often say we have the best seat in the house but if Ziggler's match idea ever comes to fruition I'm gonna make sure we're the first ones at the arena so we don't miss one second of that battle he's having a seriously hard time getting back to his feet after that of Dolph Ziggler is building once more. And Ziggler gets level. Man, Ziggler's going to be sore tomorrow. Take a look at that again. Measuring. And Rusev nails it. And we see it one more time. He anticipated that move perfectly. And there's the reversal. Dolph Ziggler makes what a maneuver. He's got him covered. No, early kick out. This, ladies and gentlemen, is the longest running weekly episodic television show in history. This is Monday Night Raw. Hey, now. Watch it. Oh, my gosh. He might make his opponent tap right here. Oh, man. Look at his face. The pain has to be crippling. Here. Let's go to the highlights here. Oh, I can't believe you want to talk about crowd pleasing. Take a look at the highlights from this match. What a physical match! Uh oh, look at that stare. Oh, no! Come on, you won the match. Enough's enough.
leave a mark. Here is John Cena wreaking havoc. And here's John Cena. Luthan Press. Great offense by John Cena. You know, Michael, there are more than a few amazing submission specialists in WWE, but I'd have to put CM Punk right at the top of that list. Any way you look at it, his holes are excruciating. Look at these two jockey for position. He almost took his head off with that lariat. You hear how his leg connected? Whoa, whoa! How awesome was that? Uh-oh, big move coming. CM Punk's submission skills are on display in just about every match Punk led a maneuver. He may get the three counts right here. Whether you like it or not, there's the match right there. Well, let's take a look at some of those highlights. Let's go to the highlights here. What happened to the light? Undertaker. Choke slam. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Friday Night SmackDown, live from Houston, Texas. We have an outstanding main event tonight, but right now, we have another match that should be exceptional. Get the world backbreaker. What a fierce kick. He drops the elbow. Get the world backbreaker. Collar and elbow battling for control. And Sheamus looking to get this capacity crowd behind him. And he's heading back in. Oh, out of nowhere! Rob Van Dam has got some bad intentions here. A quick reversal by Sheamus. Oh, his back crashing into the ground. Sheamus has eyes to finish. That's it. He's out. Oh, he's in trouble now. Hey, it. Sheamus with a wicked boot. Here's the cover. I don't believe it. This one's over. And here's just some of the action we saw during the match. Well, let's take a look at some of those highlights. Here is your winner. The Celtic Warrior, Sheamus! Man, what a contest! We definitely just witnessed one for the ages!
Get used to seeing Paige in a WWE ring tank. I don't think she's going anywhere for quite a while. Oh, I agree completely, Cole. This girl's special. She's going to be making waves in the Divas division for years to come. What do you think Paige's mindset is right now? Well, I talked to her earlier tonight about the success she's been having, and she basically said, what do you expect? I practice and work hard, and I've earned everything I'm getting right now. Paige using her feet right there. Oh, man, what a shot. Well, it looks like Paige has got the momentum. Playing my games. Yeah, a little intimidation there. Collar and elbow battling for control. Here's a girl in Paige that was told she wasn't pretty enough to be a WWE diva. And that she needed to change who she was. She needed to be like everybody else. And you know what she did? Nothing. She just went about her business, determined to become the best diva in the business, and look at her now. Yeah, and you know how you know she's truly determined? She went out on her own at age 14 and traveled all over the world, perfecting her craft in France, Germany, Belgium, Norway, you name it, she's been there. What a night it's been so far, but remember, we have that tremendous main event still to come. Well, we've talked about one for the ages, Michael, and that's just what we have in store tonight. You have to imagine that Paige's travels have played a huge role in her becoming the groundbreaking diva she's become. I mean, in a relatively short period of time, she went on to become the first NXT Women's Champion, as well as the first to hold both that title and the WWE Divas title, signed with an astonishing maneuver by Paige. A quick cover. Ref found a two count. Stay down! Stay down! to put her away. You gotta be kidding me. Devastating. Simply devastating. We got a cover. Two. Three. And Paige is your winner. And here's some highlights from the matchup. Let's, let's see what happened during that incredible matchup. Here is your winner, Paige. Now let's be honest, this one wasn't even close. Oh yeah, that was about as far from it. Daniel Bryan might be the greatest submission specialist in WWE. Hey, you must fear those holes and fear the beard. What a story this young man Daniel Bryan's had. Well, to quote good old JR, the way he feels about his opponent tonight, I would expect this match to turn bowling shoe ugly. And here comes Kevin Nash. Too much. out of the ring and it might be time for him to reassess the situation you hear how his leg connected certainly had that one well scouted. Yeah, that's because Daniel Bryan is so prepared every time he steps in the ring. Six. Daniel seems to think he... Has and it's imperative he gets back in the ring right now. He gets out of trouble there. 
Now here's something about Daniel Bryan that sets him apart from other WWE superstars. What's that, Michael? He actually won an award in 2012 for being the country's most animal-friendly athlete. Oh, man. But I have to say, I'm not sure just what to make of that. Oh, and he lands that one right to the head. Uh-oh. Oh, jeez. Oh, Woo, a little showboating going on here. He's having a seriously hard time getting back to his feet after that. Kevin Ash is looking for the decisive end. That's it. He's out. He's going for the pin. Two, three. Kevin Nash did it. Kevin Nash got a huge win. Well, let's take a look at some of those highlights. Of highlights here. Let's check them out. Here is your winner, representing the NWO, Kevin Nash. Man, what a contest! We definitely just witnessed one for the ages.